welcome back to my channel in this tutorial we are going to learn how to set up visual studio code for angular application development by following its official documentation so let's get started at first download visual studio code from its official website i am going to download visual studio code for ubuntu click here to download i already have downloaded it on my machine so i am going to navigate to the download folder open in terminal okay now i am going to install visual studio code on my machine using this command sudo dpkg i and then the package name with dot dev extension then hit enter now enter the password for the specified user it may take a while for unpacking and installing the visual studio code okay now i am going to verify the installation open application launcher and search for visual studio code that's it visual studio code installed successfully to setting up the visual studio code for angular application we need to install angular application on my machine so go back to the documentation and then click on docs and expand node.js javascript menu and then click on angular tutorial to test that you have node.js and npm correctly installed on your machine you can type node version and npm version to verify I am going to verify node hyphen hyphen version also npm hyphen hyphen version if you don't have installed node.js and npm on your system install using this command sudo apt install node.js and npm this is the latest LTS version of node.js and this is the current version of node.js I am going to install the latest LTS version okay hit enter now enter the password for the specified user okay now type y to continue installation hit enter it may take a while for installing node.js and npm now verify the node.js and npm installation again In my machine installed node.js version is 12 and npm version is 8.5 but i want to install the latest lts version so clear the screen and then follow this official documentation copy this command and type sudo privilege before this command okay 
now hit enter and then copy this command to update the node version to its latest LTS version use sudo privilege before this command always okay now verify exit terminal and then open a new terminal that's it and also update the node version to its latest version use sudo privilege now verify that's it and then install angular cli in a terminal or command prompt copy this command and then go back to terminal or command prompt paste this command use sudo privilege before this command hit enter it may take a while for installing angular cli so vacations okay let's verify the angular installation using this command ng version would you like to enable auto completion then type y otherwise type n if you want to share the uses data with the angular team at google type y otherwise type n hit enter that's it angular cli installed successfully now i am going to create a new angular application using this command i am going to create an angular application and store this application to the desktop so use cd command use this command and then enter the application name if you want to add angular routing to your application type y otherwise type n and then select the style sheet format it may take a while for installing necessary packages for this angular application using npm okay angular application has been created and the packages installed successfully now i am going to navigate to the angular application using change directory command okay now open this application with visual studio code simply type this command code space dot
okay the application will be opened as a workspace okay now select this option now install angular language service extension also install angular snipes extension okay now expand source folder and then expand app and open app dot component dot ts okay i am going to increase the font size of visual studio code okay visual studio code supports syntax highlighting and bracket matching for angular application and also support intelligence as you hover your mouse over text in the file you will see that visual studio code gives you information about key items in your source code items such as variables classes and angular decorators are a few examples where you will be presented with this information like component hover the mouse over component here you will see the information about component also selector also style urls or title this is the property okay as you start typing in app.component.ts you will see smart suggestions and code snipes i'm going to type that's it you can click the information button i to see a layout with more documentation Through the TypeScript language service, Visual Studio Code can also provide type definition information in the editor through go to definition by pressing F12 function key or pick definition by pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus F10. Often app.module.ts file and put the cursor of her app component in the bootstrap property declaration then right click and go to definition that's it you are into the app.component.ts file now now put the mouse over app component and then press F12. That's it. Now I'm going to start the development server of Angular application. Go back to terminal or you can get the terminal from Visual Studio Code click on this 
and then select terminal okay it will navigate you to the root directory of your application automatically now type this command ng serve then hit enter this command will generate browser application bundles now open your browser on this url press control and then click here that's it now expand and open app.component.html file and i'm going to remove all of the component i am going to define the property title here to display the application name on a web browser that's it if you want to stop the development server go to the terminal and then press ctrl plus c that's it if you are new to this channel subscribe this channel and like comment share thank you so much for watching this video